Hi everyone, this is Sharon. Um, I just got into the Bible journaling and I just wanted to go over a page that I did today. I meant to videotape it and I forgot. I'm not used to doing that. So anyway, um, the journal page that I did was on the story of Susanna, which comes from the 13th chapter of Daniel. And it's about a woman a very beautiful woman who is being watched by two elders um, and the respected people in the Jewish culture, yet they're kind of lusting after, not kind of, they are lusting after this woman. So anyhow, um, one day she's out with her maidens bathing in the garden and uh, the maidens walk away to give her time alone, and these two men decide to come after her. And she gets very frightened, and they tell her that they want her to lay with them. And if she refuses, that they're going to lie and tell everyone that she seduced them. And anyway, that's what it came to. She screamed for help. And it went to to a judge and they were going to convict her and stone her to death when Daniel steps in after she prays to God. And Daniel comes and asks the men privately a question about where the other one was laying with her, and neither one could answer correctly. So it ultimately freed her. And so anyway, I did this, this these two pages, actually. I, I wrote in here, the truth will set you free kind of reminded me of Martin Luther King and the Bible and all of that. And then I also put in a, gag, a gavel and I uh, wrote down justice here. Then over here on this page um, is where I wrote or painted my depiction of the garden that she was in and the men luring or uh, looking at her through the gate and the trees and everything. So uh, what I did, this was actually very easy to do, so I don't think I really need to do a video on it, but I used watercolor. I just quickly penciled some outlines of where I wanted trees to be and put them in there. And then I put in some stones for the gate and a door walkway. And then I basically just painted in watercolor with a water brush with very little water and put it on the page that was not prepped in advance. Um, so I was trying to be very careful. Uh, it looks like the page is torn here, but actually it's just a water line. Oops, I'm sorry, I'm off of camera here. It's just a water line that you see here, it's not torn. So then after I finished with that, I went back with my, with my Faber-Castell polychromos pencils and I went ahead and added some pencil color like to the trees to give them a little more depth. Um, I did it up here too. And then also on the wood on the gate. And then I added a few sprigs of grass here and there. And that was about it. it. It was very quick and simple and it was a lot of fun. So I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great night everybody. God bless.